Beezin is really, really, really dope. Like. Yo, yo, reason, reason. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that's reason. <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, we are back, and it's your boy Reezy, and we're here at uh, <laughs> Trivaloli. Pawajibewa. <laughs> Okay, so what they are feeling is uh, Lobo is like uh, I will put him up in you guys low, low, yeah, Valentine. And uh, Valentine is around the corner, so <laughs> the question is, come on, hallelujah. Anyway, shout out to Nomo for providing us with this. Like a like a lot. I will not lose the cheat, I will only ask you, but it's okay, it's all right. Anyway, talking about new issues, we have new issues emanating in the world and uh, in Zimbabwe. So what's happened, what's been happening is uh, we have a situation where, let's talk about Valentine. Valentine, do we know Kutiaga Vakopi? And now it seems like it's, it's, it's an African thing. Dude, what you need to understand is, as Africans, Mastate Guridu Vavasina Valentine. From what I understand, there was Valentino. And yeah, because of Valentine, Isuzu is a men's conference organizer of this year. It is happening. Kuvamsa 12, Kuvamsa 16. Wakumana Yesi Aringa Siriku Batika, there will be a conference. So yeah, and also a uh, funny thing, Kuchache, <laughs> I think I'll put up something, yeah. Anyway, the next thing that I'm talking about is uh, Anzi, girls stay if they are being treated right in a relationship. All right, can you get girls as broke, guy? Absolutely. But I just need you to understand, guys, that when you get girls being broke, what's going to happen is your retention rates are going to go down because at some point girls are going to want that security. And if you're not able to provide that on top of the game and the good looks or whatever you're using, you're probably going to lose the girl to some simp that will send her a thousand dollars a week. That's the game, guys. Women always look for security first. Okay. Game, confidence, etc. works, but to keep her, you need to have yourself together. My question is, is that fake is that fact or false is that statement normative or a positive statement that's some economic shit <laughs> so from that from what i understood from that statement is uh if you are treating a girl right and if you are giving them money ah they will stay do you think that's correct or not comment down below in tr anyway the next sort of the topic is uh be talking about um so many things vibes Toki vibes. Oh, shout out to Toki vibes over there. <laughs> I'll <need> to <Toki. laughs> Anyway, so there's this thing that that's, that that was being talked about on this chat room, and it has the difference between um, YouTube or my ISP versus uh, my terrestrial. So when 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 I'm talking about them saying when I'm saying material to true we mean about these things either say T V and all that versus internet service providers and which uh, which one between the two are people leaning over to? Are people leaning over to Tenga data more than Guba T V license and T V license you know most of that item is censored. Most of the thing that's happening on um, on on T V censored and you know what he, YouTube and all that is unfiltered. So you as yourself, which one would you choose? Kuonama program pa TV or kuonapa internet? Joram, what would you choose? TV or internet? Internet. So anyway, so with that, those ISPs, uh, those service, internet service providers, they should know good to take out data. And uh, my content uh, creators, I guess, is, 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 we should be getting paid by retail, all <laughs> equal and all that, because they win on both ends. You understand? I buy data to upload, a customer buys data to watch, and all the profit is going to quarry. So, ISP providers change your ways. Yeah. So, uh, talking about the artist of the day today, we'll be talking about Sounds Machine. I think I'll put up something, just Sounds Machine, and you guys check it out. It's a guy from uh, Sanctuary Records in MK. 
Sanctuary Records, shout out and shout out to Mook Mesh, producer at Sanctuary Records. I think I did an uh, uh, I did an episode at Sanctuary. And you guys should check it out. Shout out. Generational music. Death is calling me on my landline They trying to put me face on the front line It's getting dark when I'm trying to shine Too much trouble in my way, it's never fine I got many dreams in my head We out <laughs> hey, Thank you to the subscribers